so let us start with the class on tongue so it is a, one of the important topics which you are supposed to know in the head and neck session so it is usually asked as a main question and uh, there are many subheadings in which you are supposed to say learn uh, about tongue so i'll just tell you first the subheadings uh, so and then we will switch over to each component so i'll cut the video into small uh, sessions and then uh, you will be able to learn about like each component of tongue in detail so let us start with the first session so that is nothing but uh, the definition of tongue so what is exactly tongue so so it's a fibromuscular glandular organ fibromuscular glandular organ which is located within the oral cavity so when you look at the location of the tongue it is one of the true contents of the oral cavity so oral cavity is divided into oral cavity proper plus vestibule so tongue lies within the oral cavity so vestibule means it is the gap between the lips and then the cheek and then the gums as well as the teeth and then the oral cavity proper it lies beyond the teeth so what what is the definition so it's a fibromusculoglandular organ so which is located so within the oral cavity proper okay so this is the definition now so when we start writing about the location of the tongue so i tell you so we usually follow one common diagram so this you can observe so i keep telling all the students regarding this so henceforth whatever the structures you are going to study so the next class when you uh, take into consideration so that is the uh, lateral wall of the nasal cavity and then the medial wall of the nasal cavity then pharynx then larynx so when we are learning all these things so you are going to write the same diagram so carefully follow the diagram what i am going to learn sorry uh, teach you guys okay so this is one of the common diagrams what you are supposed to learn so this is one point then what are all the headings under which we are supposed to study the tongue so first is you will be learning about location so where exactly it is located what forms the roof what forms the floor so what are the parts of the tongue okay so and then the gross features of tongue so location plus gross features then next comes the the core of the tongue is formed by the muscles so what are the types of muscles do we see here so and then third one is histology histology i am not going to discuss any again because we have already learnt about the histology of tongue then the fourth point is so you will have to study about the yes the nerve supply blood supply and then the lymphatic drainage of tongue out of which the lymphatic drainage is very very important again it is asked as a short essay question nerve supply again the in relation with or in correlation with the development we will we will have to learn and then fifth one is applied anatomy so these are the things subheadings in which you are supposed to study so this is actually a main question for 10 marks so otherwise each component can be asked as a short essay question also especially the applied anatomy then the development in correlation with nerve supply lymphatic drainage itself and then the muscles of the tongue so histology of tongue so all these are short essay questions now let us start with the first uh, 